However, when it comes to the best man speech, no one comes to listen to 10 minutes of pleasantries about how great he is. Um, and I think Dave knew that, but he said to him Monday night, he said, mate, could you not rip his in the speech? And I've absolutely said, we've done, we've done it, we've not done it, um, we've, not, we've taken him on board, we're not going to rip me in this speech, um, instead we're going to rip you a song. So, without further ado, let's begin our ode to our groom with a twist on a classic that's sung in many a bar in Ireland. No, not that of The wrong island. So, without further ado, Stephen will do. So, we'll sing the chorus a couple of times. And then feel free to join in after the first eight times you might get it. <laughs> yeah, it's a lot of the tune, so once we get there, I'll just join in. So... <laughs> la, 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 la. <laughs> so we have known Dave G for many a year. We bonded over football in Buckfast and Pia. And now on this day that he has got wed, We'll start with the naughty things he does in bed. <laughs> so he likes to keep Chloe up all night long as he's practicing lines of a new Celtic song. <laughs> with a wee cup of tea and two jammy dodgers. The only name spilled is the bull Brendan Young. <laughs> it's Dave G's story that we tell on this date. It's a glorious tribute <laughs> to our big ginger mate. <laughs> when I first met David, it was very brief. But then one week later, we were both in Tenerife. <laughs> it started with a handshake, but there was no love. Until DG found out about my latex glove. <laughs> a day by the pool, and Dave did not find fun. He ended up beetroot, all oh, thanks to the sun. I tripped to the doctors, it was such a farce. I had to rub the cream all over his shoulders. It's the G's story that we tell on the stage. It's a glorious tribute to a big ginger lead. Me and Big Dave went to Costa del Sol. And back at that age, I thought I'd seen it all. Dave showed me his smooth moves, a step and a twirl. I wondered what effect that would have on a girl. <laughs> so we went out that night and we drank quite a lot. Two for one on the vodkas in the standard free shot. Then out on the dance floor, a blonde stepped on his toes. Long story short, Swayze here broke her nose and it's the <laughs> story that we tell on the stage. It's a glorious tribute to a big ginger maid. Hitting girls and the dance music was a mistake. Now DJ Dave Grant loves playing Kanye and Drake. But Saturday nights, he still likes to get sweaty. He's phoning George Bowie for a shout out to Betty. <laughs> and it's Dave. <laughs> and he thinks his paddle's in a league of its own. But we think that he might have Tourette syndrome. <laughs> He'll be sitting there quiet before an episode. And the next thing he's shouting, there's oh, 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 the road. And it's Dave's story. That we tell on this stage, it's a glorious tribute to a big ginger maid. So we've not painted Dave in the bestest of wine. 
But take it from us, the big man's all right. We were nervous for this bit, but we don't have to lie. This Egypt looks dapper in his tux and bow tie. Come to think of it now, it's his biggest passion. He likes to think he's in with the latest fashion. We give him so much grief, believe you and me. He spends a grand on white ankle socks you'll never see. <laughs> and it's the story that we tell on the stage. It's a glorious tribute to a big ginger maid. When they first met Chloe, he said, boy, she's all right. But we saw in his eyes it was love at first sight. The same can't be said for the former Miss Bree. He was shot down in flames for all of us to see. <laughs> he pulled out his best moves and tried like a bear. We thought that the issue was his ginger hair. <laughs> but they persevered. And now here come the Oz. Because it wasn't long after she was playing with his... Emotions, it's <laughs> Dave G's story. <laughs> that we tell on this date. It's a glorious tribute to a big ginger maid. <laughs> it was time for the first date and he asked all the guys, what chemist should I go to to get the supplies? We thought of his gallus, but no, his nails were in bits. He bought and wore these on his sweaty armpits. <laughs> Several years down the line and countless more dates, the happy couple decided to become roommates. And the next bit's quite juicy, so please bear with us. We didn't have enough wines left, so here's a chorus. And it's Davey's story that we tell on the street. It's a glorious tribute to a big ginger mate. Now any good boyfriend with the time that they've spent would support their girlfriend when observing Lent. But no, not Big Dave G, because he's a rocket. He was busted with two dairy milks in his pocket. <laughs> but the greatest dispute that all came from Dave. It was almost two days that it took him to save. He was nearly back single, all well, thanks to his bum. No Febreze meant that Chloe moved back with her mum. <laughs> and it's the story that we tell on this date. It's a glorious tribute to a big ginger me. Great clap, by the way. <laughs> on to the proposal. We couldn't leave that bit out. They've got a shop that we'll tell you about. Engaged at Christmas, presents under the tree. And together, the bag spell, will you marry me? She got lots of gifts, but the number one thing. It should have been her sparkling engagement ring. But the truth of the matter, Chloe got such a thrill. When she got concert tickets, Bieber won Dave Grant Nell and his <laughs> Dave story. That we tell on this day, it's a glorious tribute to a big ginger maid. With the wedding in motion, his freedom was over. His stag dues resembled scenes from the hangover. The first stop was Glasgow, and we had text a dare. Drinking pints while doing handstands with his feet in the air. <laughs> now listen up, Dave G, we've a lesson to teach. Cos what happens in Benidorm goes in this speech. <laughs> Six boys on a lad's trip, we thought we were cool. We just drank spun off ice and did tricks in the pool. And it's the <laughs> story <laughs> that we tell on the stage. It's a glorious tribute to a big ginger maid. So we've gone through this speech without any dangers. It's the only sort of song that's not mentioned, Rangers. <laughs> this day has been perfect here at the lockside. Cheers, Dave G, for having me along for the ride. I want to thank you as well. It's been such an honour. But I still think the main should have been chips, cheese and donna. <laughs> Sadly, we've come to the end now. That's enough from us. There's just time for one final special chorus. And it's David and Chloe. For the rest of their lives, so let's all raise our glass to the new husband and wife.
Ladies and gentlemen, for one last time, if you could put your hands together for your top table speakers.